I was Kobe's gangster rap album never released. Did you know he even had one? In the words of Kevin Durant, every basketball player wants to be a rapper. And over the past 30 years, we've seen a number of examples of this. From AI's infamous mixtape to Dame's freestyle. But one of the most overlooked and often disregarded rap careers in the NBA actually belonged to the Mamba. Smack dab in the middle of the retirement of Michael Jordan and the introduction of LeBron James, Kobe was arguably the biggest name in the NBA. The only other player to match his star power was actually his teammate, Shaq, who put together quite the discography through the 90s. Shaq released several albums, most notably Shaq Diesel, which sold over 1 million copies. And the head marketer for Sony's urban music department, Steve Stout, felt like he'd be able to replicate that success with Kobe. So in 2000, he'd work with Bryant on putting together a 16-track project. The album, titled Visions, featured some of the most established artists in music, like 50 Cent, Black Thought, and even Beyonce. And while that definitely sounds like a recipe for success, a gangster rap album didn't really fit Kobe's image. I mean, LL Cool J said listening to the album was one of the funniest moments of his life as he was just confused what Kobe was even trying to accomplish. And Columbia Records seemed to share that same sentiment. The project's debut single, K.O.B.E., featuring Tyra Banks, failed to live up to the label's expectations and the project was quietly dropped. And the rest of the album remained a mystery for the next two decades. But in May of 2021, it was fully recovered and leaked online. And today, you can find the entire Visions album actually on YouTube.